You want a vaccine prank call? Maybe that's uh, fitting. What's a vaccine prank call? Don't be pranking around with the vaccine. Well, you know, Sal and Richard have many, many prank calls as they are Fred and Ethel characters. <laughs> that's the um, Fred and Ethel characters where Richard plays a woman but doesn't bother to change his voice. And everybody says, uh, can I help you, sir? <laughs> yeah. They call into radio shows posing as an old married couple. And the, um, the premise is always absurd, but it's amazing what people will believe. Just to refresh your memory, because I know my memory's shot, so yours must be too. But um, here, this is when Ethel was mad at Fred for being a drunk. So she pushed him into traffic. They called into a show, and it's absurd, but uh, here we go. Blue is hey. the last straw, Fred. I'm kicking you out of the house, dude, literally. Oh, that dumb old hag just kicked my wheelchair down the hill. Seriously. Roll on down to Alcoholics Anonymous, you stupid old boo. Hey, Help me, please. I'm rolling right into traffic. <laughs> okay. A um, little bit of a strange morning. Yeah, a little strange. <laughs> then there was the time that Fred yelled at Ethel for spraying feces everywhere after the prayers cured her constipation. Do you remember this one? Ah, uh, yes. They called into a religious show and they said it worked. She was constipated and then she started <laughs> shitting everywhere. <laughs> Hallelujah. Okay, keep praying. It's coming out. And again, I say unto you, oh, in the Lord. name of Jesus and the Fred, bring me the mop. I finally went, and it got all over me in the rocket chair. Hey, no, no, we watch your language. Stop. Good God, Ethel. You even got it on the ceiling. That's enough. Ethel, you blew your whole goddamn ass out. <laughs> okay, let, let's, let's reset. All right. Jeez. Messy. So, uh, okay. This might be the silliest of them all. You tell me. All right. With vaccines uh, obviously dominating the news and dominating the show and in light of Bubba and everything else, Fred and Ethel called an internet health show and claimed they were getting vaccinated live on air. All right. All right. Good morning, everyone. Hopefully no one retarded comes on the show today. As I do want to take this show seriously. Hold on. Go ahead. Hey, cuz. Well, fortunately for you, this is a very serious call. Okay. Don't you agree everybody should be getting their vaccines? Definitely get your vaccine. Um, let's do our part. Wear your mask, wash your hands. I actually have some great news for you. My wife, Ethel, was a nurse back in WW2. Wow, okay. And she's going to give me my vaccine right here, right now. You want to hear it? I don't know if you should be administering a vaccine on your own. There you go, Fred. Woohoo! I'm vaccinated. Um, did she do the proper alcohol oh, wipe? Oh, sticks, Fred. I just jabbed you with our dog Petey's hookworm medicine. Oh, no. Oh, I mixed up the darn vials. Oh, my. So, the plot thickens. So, Fred was injected with the dog's hookworm medicine. Yes. And he started to feel very odd. He got these weird side effects. Right away, uh, uh, just weird shit started happening. And the host is trying to help him out. This is unbelievable. I'm already feeling the side effects. <laughs> um, well, what kind of side effects are you having on it, sir? Well, <laughs> I'm really itching all of a sudden. <laughs> I'm, with, I'm writing down your symptoms and stuff so I can try and see. Um, if you can, cow mine, bath, uh, maybe even an oatmeal bath, the, uh, you know, the rolled oat. Oatmeal, okay. Or some of that in your bath water. <laughs> now I'm starting to get really thirsty, too. I actually need some water right now. Drink room temperature water. Oh, no. He's drinking out of the toilet. Oh. Oh, God. What am I doing? I've never been this thirsty. Trying to swell the thirst and keep hydrated. And this water tastes like shit. Because <laughs> um, it is shit, Fred. You know my colitis has been acting up. Oh, no. Oh, God, fecal matter. Let's try and remain calm. Yeah. From what I'm looking at, this is mostly normal. People are feeling the same thing. Ugh, um, that's it, Fred. Get it all out. <laughs> you might want to call your hospital right now. Wow. You think? <laughs> Fred, 
Fred started licking his own balls and sniffing Ethel's ass. It was too much for the host. She finally caught on that perhaps this was a phony phone call. Oh, goodness the gracious. Now Fred's licking his own balls. Mm -hmm. Okay, so seriously? Is that a common side effect? What are you talking about? (laughs) Now Fred's sniffing my ass. Get away, you mongo. This is, this should be weird. Guess he got a taste for it. Damn, boy. Oh, my God, dude. Oh, my God. That was... That was just, oh my God, don't come on here and waste my time. I hope he's fucking working. Hold on. <laughs> she got pissed. She said before she started, I hope we don't get any retarded calls today. Guess what? We're always ready. <laughs> we have a whole retarded department of people to call in. <laughs> then, of course, just to bust balls, they call back. Fred was now completely transformed into a rabid dog because he took the hookworm medicine. Right, and right. He was going nuts, and the host was not amused. She was really pissed. Thank you for waiting. Go ahead. Sorry, we got cut off. It's Ethel again. We, uh, you, sir. Thanks a lot for nothing, for distracting me. I gave my husband the wrong vaccine. Now that our house is a disaster. You create this fucking disaster. It's your goddamn fault. Oh, there's Cletus, the mailman. Fred, get back here. Don't you dare chase him. Stop the dumb shit, you fucking brainless tour. <laughs> oh, no. Fred bit Cletus. Shut <laughs> the fuck up. Ah, could you please? Thank you. <laughs> I just had to end this fucking call. Oh, my God. You guys, that was the weirdest, weirdest call. I just turned it off. I need a break. I just like, uh. <laughs> to be honest, um, when I'm around those guys, I need a break, too. It's exhausting. <laughs> But it was a very cinematic call. I don't know why you're mm-hmm. upset. It was very entertaining. Yeah, I just got a call from Paramount Pictures. They want to make that into a movie. That whole <laughs> phony phone call was so epic. The whole uh, old guy turning into a dog. Yeah. <laughs> this is, again, a warning. You need to leave vaccination to the professionals. Do not inject yourself with your dog's hookworm medicine and transform into a dog. Just want to make sure people at home know Well, that. why didn't that person who was taking calls know that Ethel wouldn't have vaccine at her home anyway? She uh, she got confused. You know, sometimes when you're on the air, you don't realize. 